I'm always teaching my daughters and my son about tomorrow. Here's a principle. Now for then. Everybody say it. Now for then. Now, wait a minute here. Somebody's typing right now. Somebody's watching on social media and they said, did Bishop say now for then? Oh, so now Bishop is in the church teaching Buddhism. You're right. In the lesson, in the teachings on Buddhism, it means that what you're doing now is for then. The church teaches what happened then is for now. So we always play with this testimony. It's going to come out all right. No, the Buddhists don't have that problem. Because they're taking into consideration that if I'm kind now, someone will be kind to me then. And if I prep now, that whatever I need, it'll be in place then. Why can't I pull from all these different places the principles and the truths that are right and that are proper? What are you doing now that's going to secure you for later on? So I say to them, I say to them, my sons and my daughters, I say to them, I'm trying to get you to understand that if you consume everything now, you have nothing for later.